we are, Charlotte Putting League. We got our mixed division back. Who do we got in the finals? Anthony Gale. And? Sarah Nicholson. Versus? Vicky Bacoris. And? Kara Richardson. All right, here we go. Let's get on playing up to 15. Got to win by two. Got our, we got nine ladies here tonight. The last couple weeks, we haven't had a mixed division, but we got one tonight. We got Tara Richardson, who's been here before. We got a brand new Charlotte Putting League player in Sarah Nicholson. Playing up to 15. We play up to 15 in the mixed division. Sarah Nicholson works over at Innova now. Usually works the late shift. May able to make it out here tonight for the first time. We're happy to host her. And here she is in the final round versus Tara Richardson, who's always hungry for a win. She's very competitive. These ladies can, but it is one enough. Their partners can also putt. We got some old school Charlatans here. We got Aunt Gail who's been around forever. We got Dickie Bacoris, who's putting right now. You can always find Dickie somewhere around Dry Creek where Mark Savard's backyard putting holds the current record out there. This guy can putt, so can Ant, as they're proving it to you right now. Single putts are worth one point. If you get them both in, that is worth three points. Doubles is where it is at. You can really run the score up if you can hit them doubles. As both of those guys show you right there. I'd like to thank, speaking of uh, Sarah's employment over to Innova, we've been sponsored by Innova since year one. And this is year five. Uh, Innova Champion Discs down at Rock Hill. They provide us with these best catching baskets on the market, Innova Pro 28s. They also provide the winners of both the men's and the mixed brackets. As long as they putt with Innova putters, we call that the Innova Bounty, and they each get Two free putters of their choice. Tara hits her second one. As does Sarah. These are the ladies that come out to Charlotte Putting League. I'll tell you, they can putt. It is never a disappointment to get in the mixed bracket. It's always a good time. We're glad that we had them. Good turnout. Dickie knew it out of his hands. A little short. Dickie's definitely one of the more animated characters out here at Putting League. Always good to see him. And follow suit. And short arms it. Dickie not making the adjustment. Let's see if Ant can make the adjustment. And he does. Ties it up. Five to five. play it's the same as long as it's tied if nobody else got it. it is still the same team Sarah hits her first one Tara maybe an open frame let's see if Sarah can capitalize and get the double oh very close very close And jumps out with the lead. Drains his first. Let's see if Dickie can make the adjustment. And he does. Drills it. Heart of the chains. We got ourselves a double on Ant's team. Dickie shorts it again. He's walking back, man. He knows it. He knows it. Team Sarah and Ant starting to run away with it, although it is only three points. A lot can change in the course of a turn. Sarah drilling the center. Tara answering back. Let's see if, let's see if one of these ladies can get the double. Sarah nails the double. Sarah and Tara, let's see if Tara can do it as well. And she does! Yeah. 
big reaction from the crowd here. They love to see that. Always fun. Ant has a chance to end it here. If he doubles, it is over. He's halfway home. Dickie needs this in case Ant misses. Yep, this is the hardest putt to hit in putting league for the win. And he does it. That is game over. We got a first time putting league visitor and a player and a first time winner. That is it. That was quick. Yeah. Good sportsmanship. Always great sportsmanship in the mixed bracket. Congratulations, Ant and Sarah. First time out. Way to go. He carried me the whole way. Oh, please. <laughs> well, we're excited. Thanks. Nicely done.